Welcome, Kabuma travelers, to the enchanting city of Amsterdam, a place where history, culture, and modern flair dance alongside the winding canals. Join us as we explore this vibrant metropolis, famously known as the Venice of the North. Picture a city where narrow gabled houses line the banks of tranquil waterways, where the gentle hum of bicycle chains is the soundtrack, and where art and innovation are woven into the very fabric of daily life. This is Amsterdam, a city that balances its rich past with a lively, progressive present. Let's start at the heart of the city, Dam Square. Here, history stands tall at the Royal Palace, where Dutch monarchs are inaugurated. Nearby, the National Monument pierces the sky, a solemn reminder of those lost in World War II. The bustling square, a blend of street performers, tourists, and locals, is the pulse of the city. As you wander through the city, the iconic canals of Amsterdam are a sight to behold. Over 100 kilometers of waterways connect the city, flanked by paths perfect for a leisurely bike ride or a relaxing stroll. These canals are not just picturesque. They tell the story of a historic trading city that flourished in the Dutch Golden Age. Art enthusiasts rejoice. Amsterdam is a treasure trove of artistic heritage. The Van Gogh Museum houses the world's largest collection of Van Gogh paintings, while the Rijksmuseum showcases masterpieces by Rembrandt and Vermeer. And let's not forget the modern art marvels at the Stedelijk Museum. For a poignant journey through history, the Anne Frank House offers a glimpse into the life of the young diarist and the Jewish experience during the Holocaust. It's a powerful reminder of the city's wartime history and a tribute to resilience and hope. Amsterdam's culinary scene is as diverse as its culture. From cozy cafes serving traditional Dutch pancakes to high-end restaurants offering international cuisines, there's something to satisfy every palate. And the city's love affair with coffee ensures there's always a cafe nearby to rest and recharge. As the sun sets, Amsterdam transforms. The red light district, known for its liberal attitudes, comes alive with neon lights and a buzzing atmosphere. Meanwhile, the city's nightlife offers everything from brown cafes, steeped in history, to cutting edge nightclubs where you can dance the night away. If you seek tranquility, the Vondel Park is Amsterdam's green lung a sprawling park perfect for picnics, outdoor concerts, or simply watching the world go by. For a taste of local life, the Jordan neighborhood, with its charming boutiques and art galleries, offers a more laid-back, quintessentially Amsterdam experience. And let's not forget the city's surroundings. A short trip from Amsterdam, the picturesque Dutch countryside unfolds with windmills, tulip fields, and quaint villages. The Zanse Schans, with its historic windmills, and the Kuchenhof, known as the Garden of Europe, are just a stone's throw away. We're going to go in detail through all these things and more. And remember, if you're loving the adventures on Kabuma Travel, smash that like button, click subscribe, and ring that notification bell to join us on every epic journey. Let's get started. Best time to go to Amsterdam. Amsterdam, with its distinct seasons, offers varied experiences throughout the year. Each season in this Dutch capital paints the city in a different hue, offering unique experiences. Let's find out when Amsterdam is at its charming best for you. Spring, March to May. Spring in Amsterdam is a burst of color. This is the time when the famous tulips are in full bloom. The Kuchenhof Gardens open their doors to showcase an ocean of flowers, a spectacle that attracts visitors from around the globe. The weather is pleasantly mild, perfect for leisurely canal cruises and bike rides. Plus, the celebration of King's Day in late April fills the city with orange-clad revelers, free markets, and festive spirit. Summer, June to August. Summer brings long, sunny days to the city, the terraces are bustling and the Vondel Park is alive with open-air concerts and picnics. It's peak tourist season, so the city's iconic spots like the Anne Frank House and Van Gogh Museum are crowded, but the vibrant energy and lively street scenes are hard to resist. Don't miss the chance to experience the unique Amsterdam Gay Pride, with its famous canal parade in August. Autumn, September to November. As the leaves change color, Amsterdam transforms into a picturesque canvas of reds and yellows. The tourist crowds thin, giving a more relaxed vibe to the city. It's a great time to explore indoor attractions like the Rijksmuseum or enjoy a cozy cafe. The cultural season kicks off with fascinating film and art festivals, offering a deep dive into the city's artistic soul. Winter December to February. Winter has its own charm in Amsterdam. The city lights up with the Amsterdam Light Festival, where artists from around the world illuminate the canals with spectacular light installations. The festive season brings delightful Christmas markets, and if you're lucky, the canals might freeze over, turning them into magical ice skating rinks. It's cold, but the charm of a snowy Amsterdam is undeniable. Special tips for your visit. Tip one, accommodation, book well in advance, especially if you plan to visit during the tulip season or summer. 
Tip two, biking. Experience the city like a local. Rent a bike, but be sure to familiarize yourself with the rules and bike lanes. Tip three, museum visits. Consider buying tickets online to avoid long queues, especially for popular museums. Tip four, weather prep. Amsterdam's weather can be unpredictable. Always carry an umbrella and dress in layers. Tip five, explore beyond. Take day trips to nearby towns like Harlem or Zanse Schans to experience the Dutch countryside. Budget for traveling to Amsterdam. Dreaming of a Dutch adventure in Amsterdam but worried about your wallet? Fear not. Today, we're diving into tips and tricks for exploring this vibrant city on a budget. Let's navigate through Amsterdam without breaking the bank. Affordable accommodations. The key to a budget-friendly stay in Amsterdam begins with where you lay your head. Consider hostels, budget hotels, or even camping sites close to the city center. Platforms like Airbnb can also offer great deals, especially if you're traveling in a group. Another tip, stay just outside the city center. Areas like Jordan or De Peep are charming and well-connected by public transport. Savvy transportation. Amsterdam is a compact city, best explored on foot or by bike. Rent a bicycle for an authentic local experience that's both cheap and healthy. If biking isn't your thing, opt for a day or multi-day public transport pass for unlimited travel on trams, buses, and metros. Eat like a local. Indulge in Amsterdam street food. From herring, Dutch herring, stands to Fibo vending machines offering croquettes. It's delicious and affordable. Visit local markets like Albert Huip for fresh, cheap eats. Also, many restaurants offer Daghap, a daily special that's often a budget-friendly option for a full meal. Free attractions and museums. Explore free sites such as the Amsterdam's Bows, a massive park, the Blumenmarkt, floating flower market, and the iconic canals. Check out free walking tours for an informative introduction to the city. Just remember to tip your guide. Also, many museums offer free entry on certain days or discounted tickets in the late afternoon. Discount cards. Consider investing in NI Amsterdam City Card, which offers free entry to many attractions, unlimited public transport, and even discounts at restaurants. Nightlife on a budget. Experience Amsterdam's vibrant nightlife without overspending. Look out for bars and clubs with no cover charge. Happy hours are common and a great way to save on drinks. Shop smart. For souvenirs, avoid the touristy shops in the city center. Instead, hunt for unique finds in the markets or thrift stores in less touristy neighborhoods. Avoid tourist traps. Steer clear of the main tourist areas where prices are inflated. Walking just a few blocks away from the city center can significantly reduce the cost of food and shopping. Data and connectivity. Instead of costly international roaming, consider purchasing a local SIM card for your data needs. You can also make the most of the free Wi-Fi available in many cafes and public spaces. Plan and book ahead. Especially for popular attractions like the Anne Frank House or Van Gogh Museum. Book your tickets online in advance to avoid more expensive last minute tickets best things to do in Amsterdam. As we embark on an unforgettable journey through Amsterdam, a city where history, culture, and modern zest blend seamlessly alongside its iconic canals, let's explore the best things to do in this vibrant land. Explore the Canal Ring. Start your adventure with a stroll or a bike ride around Amsterdam's famous Canal Ring. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is a marvel of urban planning and beauty. For a different perspective, hop on a canal cruise and glide past the city's historic houses and under its quaint bridges. Visit the Anne Frank House. Take a poignant journey through history at the Anne Frank House. The museum, dedicated to the Jewish wartime diarist, offers a moving insight into the horrors of the Holocaust. Be sure to book your tickets in advance as this is one of Amsterdam's most visited attractions. Marvel at art in the Rijksmuseum. Art lovers, rejoice. The Rijksmuseum is home to an extensive collection of Dutch art and history, including works by Rembrandt and Vermeer. Don't miss the famous Nightwatch painting. Discover the Van Gogh Museum. Immerse yourself in the world of Vincent Van Gogh. This museum holds the largest collection of his works, including Sunflowers and the Potato Eaters. It's a vivid window into the life and mind of a genius. Wander through the Jordaan. The Jordaan neighborhood, with its narrow streets, quaint boutiques, and cozy cafes, is perfect for a leisurely exploration. This area also hosts the lively Nordermarkt on weekends, a great spot for vintage finds and organic foods. Experience the Vondelpark. Join locals in their favorite urban retreat, the Vondelpark. This sprawling park is ideal for picnics, bike rides, or just lounging on the grass. In summer, enjoy free concerts at the open-air theater. Shop at the Nine Streets, De Negen Stratges. For a unique shopping experience, head to the Nine Streets. This picturesque neighborhood is full of independent boutiques, 
vintage shops, and artisanal cafes. Take a photo with the I Amsterdam sign. Though it moves around the city, finding and taking a photo with the iconic I Amsterdam sign is a must. It's a fun way to mark your visit to this vibrant city. Visit the Adam Lookout. For the best panoramic views of Amsterdam, visit the Adam Lookout. Daredevils can even swing over the edge, Europe's highest swing, situated on the rooftop. Explore the Red Light District. Experience the infamous Red Light District, known for its liberal attitudes towards sex work. It's best explored in the evening when the neon lights create a surreal atmosphere. Taste local delicacies. Indulge in Dutch cuisine. Try some raw herring from a herring cart. Sample delicious stroopwafels. And don't miss the famous Dutch cheese. Best restaurants in Amsterdam. Now we're taking a tantalizing tour of Amsterdam's culinary scene. From cozy canal-side cafes to innovative Michelin-starred restaurants, Amsterdam's dining landscape is as diverse and vibrant as the city itself. Let's embark on a gastronomic journey to discover the best places to eat in this charming Dutch capital. The Pancake Bakery. Let's start with a Dutch classic at the Pancake Bakery. Nestled near the Anne Frank House, this historic spot offers a wide variety of pancakes, from traditional Dutch to international twists. Try the classic apple and bacon pancake, a local favorite. For a taste of luxury, head to Seal Bleu. Perched on the 23rd floor of the Hotel Okura, this two Michelin-starred restaurant offers not just exquisite cuisine, but also breathtaking views of the city. The menu is a creative blend of global flavors, and each dish is a work of art. De Kass. Experience farm-to-table dining at De Kass, located in a set of greenhouses dating back to the 1920s. Specializing in Mediterranean and vegetable-centric dishes, the ingredients are sourced daily from their own nursery. It's a true treat for those seeking fresh organic meals. Guts and Glory. This unique restaurant takes you on a culinary adventure with its themed menus that change every few months. From a beef theme to Italian, Guts and Glory's innovative approach to dining promises a delightful surprise with every visit. Browerage. Thai J. Nestled next to a windmill. Browery Thai J is a brewery and pub known for its selection of organic beers. Pair a local brew with a plate of Dutch cheese or sausage for the ultimate Amsterdam experience. Restaurant Motors. For a taste of home-cooked Dutch food, Restaurant Motors, Dutch for mothers, is the place to go. The walls are adorned with photos of mothers, adding to its quirky and warm ambiance. Don't miss their traditional Dutch stamp pot. Sea Palace, enjoy authentic Chinese cuisine at Sea Palace, Europe's first floating Chinese restaurant. With its ornate decor and panoramic windows, it's the perfect spot for dim sum or Peking duck with a view. Food Holland, for a casual and diverse dining experience, visit Food Holland, an indoor food market offering a range of cuisines from Vietnamese to Italian. It's a vibrant spot to taste different flavors and enjoy the lively atmosphere. Ron Gastrobar, Michelin starred yet laid back. Ron Gastrobar serves up innovative dishes with an emphasis on quality ingredients and bold flavors. The ambiance is relaxed and the menu is approachable, making it a great spot for a special night out. Cafe Loecha, Famous for serving the best steak in Amsterdam, Café Loecha is an institution. Their buttery, tender beef stook, Dutch steak, served with white bread is simple yet utterly delicious. Natural beauty of Amsterdam. While this vibrant city is renowned for its historic canals and rich cultural tapestry, it also harbors tranquil green spaces, charming waterways, and picturesque landscapes. Let's discover the greener side of Amsterdam. Vondelpark. Our first stop is Amsterdam's most famous park, Vondelpark. This sprawling oasis in the heart of the city is a haven for locals and tourists alike. Wander through its leafy paths, relax by its peaceful ponds, and if you're lucky, catch a live performance at the open-air theater during the summer months. Amsterdam Zeebos, just a bike ride away from the city center, lies Amsterdam Zeebos, one of the largest urban parks in Europe. This extensive forest offers lush meadows, tranquil waters, and a variety of outdoor activities. Rent a canoe to explore its serene waterways, or simply enjoy a picnic amidst the verdant landscape. Hortus Botanicus. Next, let's visit one of the oldest botanical gardens in the world, Hortus Botanicus. This green sanctuary houses an impressive collection of plants and exotic flowers. The Palm House, with its tropical climate and unique species, is a must visit. Bloemendal and Zandvoort beaches. A short train ride from Amsterdam takes you to the coastal towns of Bloemendal and Zandvoort. These beaches are perfect for a day of relaxation, sunbathing, and enjoying the refreshing North Sea breeze. In summer, the beach clubs here come alive with music and parties. The Flower Strip, Ballenstreek. If you're visiting in spring, a trip to the Flower Strip is essential. This area, just outside Amsterdam, transforms into a vibrant canvas of blooming tulips, hyacinths, and daffodils. 
The colorful fields stretching out to the horizon are a truly breathtaking sight. The Canals of Amsterdam. While known for their urban charm, Amsterdam's canals are also a gateway to natural beauty. A quiet boat ride in the early morning or during sunset offers a tranquil experience, with stunning reflections of the city's architecture on the calm waters. Beatrix Park, one of Amsterdam's oldest modern city parks, Beatrix Park is a hidden gem. Known for its tranquility and beautifully designed gardens, it's a perfect spot for a leisurely stroll or a quiet afternoon. Waterland and Zaan region, just north of Amsterdam, the Waterland and Zaan region offer a glimpse into traditional Dutch landscapes. With its historic windmills, wooden houses, and expansive meadows, it's a picturesque escape from the hustle and bustle of the city. Kuchenhof Gardens. Although a bit further away, Kuchenhof Gardens is worth the trip. Often referred to as the Garden of Europe, Kuchenhof is one of the largest flower gardens in the world and is only open during the spring months. Art and architecture in Amsterdam. Now we're going to embark on a journey through the city's rich tapestry of art and architecture, a landscape dotted with historic canals, cutting-edge galleries, and architectural marvels. Let's discover the artistic soul of this captivating city, the Canal Ring. Our journey begins with Amsterdam's most iconic feature, the 17th century Canal Ring. This UNESCO World Heritage Site, with its picturesque bridges and elegant canal houses, tells a story of a flourishing golden age when Amsterdam was the center of world trade. A boat tour or a leisurely stroll along these waterways is a must. Rijksmuseum. Next, step into the Grand Rijksmuseum. This architectural masterpiece, with its Gothic and Renaissance elements, houses a vast collection of Dutch art. It's home to masterpieces by Rembrandt, Vermeer, and many others, offering a deep dive into Dutch art history. Van Gogh Museum. Nearby, immerse yourself in the world of Vincent van Gogh at the museum dedicated to his life and work. The building itself is a modern architectural gem, and inside, Van Gogh's tumultuous life story unfolds through his vibrant paintings. Stedelijk Museum. For lovers of modern and contemporary art, the Stedelijk Museum is a treasure trove. Its striking white building, often referred to as the bathtub, is a bold statement in Museum Square and a beacon for art enthusiasts. The Amsterdam School of Architecture. Explore the residential areas of Amsterdam to witness the Amsterdam School style of architecture. The Het Schip Museum, located in a former social housing complex, is a prime example, showcasing the style's unique brickwork, ornate facades, and whimsical details. Denuva Kirk, on Dam Square, Denuva Kirk, the new church, is a masterpiece of Gothic architecture. While no longer used for regular services, it hosts art exhibitions, organ concerts, and royal ceremonies. The Jordan District. Wander through the charming Jordan District, known for its narrow streets, quaint buildings, and independent art galleries. This bohemian neighborhood offers a delightful mix of the old and the new. The I Film Museum. Cross the IJ River to visit the I Film Museum, a modern architectural marvel. Its futuristic design makes it a standout on the Amsterdam skyline, and inside, you'll find a celebration of cinematic art. Artists, Amsterdam Royal Zoo, a fusion of nature and architecture, the artists. Amsterdam Royal Zoo not only offers a diverse range of wildlife, but also showcases beautiful 19th century architecture, including the majestic aquarium, public art and street art. Finally, Amsterdam is a canvas for public and street art. From sculptures in Vondelpark to vibrant murals in the NDSM wharf area, the city's artistic expression knows no bounds. Conclusion. As our Kabuma journey through the vibrant city of Amsterdam comes to a close, we find ourselves reflecting on the rich tapestry of experiences this remarkable city offers. From its iconic canals to its historic streets, Amsterdam is a city that effortlessly bridges the gap between past and present, tradition and innovation. We wandered through the labyrinth of canals, each turn revealing picturesque views that seemed straight out of a postcard. These waterways, the lifeblood of the city, told stories of a bygone era of maritime power and cultural richness, even as they continue to frame the city's contemporary hustle and bustle. In the shadow of gabled houses, we discovered the heart of Dutch art. The masterpieces of Van Gogh, Rembrandt, and Vermeer in world-renowned museums spoke to us not just of artistic genius, but also of the enduring power of human expression. Modern art, with its bold statements and innovative designs, painted a picture of a city that's constantly evolving, yet respectful of its roots. Amsterdam's culinary landscape was a delightful journey in itself, from cozy canal-side cafes to bustling street food markets, each meal was a celebration of local flavors and global cuisines, a testament to the city's diverse and inclusive spirit. 
The city's parks and green spaces offered us tranquil escapes, moments of serenity amidst the urban excitement. The Vondel Park, with its sprawling lawns and lively open-air theater, was a reminder of the Amsterdammer's love for nature and the outdoors. Nighttime in Amsterdam brought with it a different kind of energy. The glow of the red light district, the buzz of the nightclubs, and the charm of the brown cafes unveiled a city that's vibrant and alive, a city that embraces the night with the same warmth as the day. Beyond the city's borders, we found the serene Dutch countryside. The windmills, tulip fields, and quaint villages were a nod to the Netherlands' rich heritage, landscapes that have inspired artists and poets for centuries. But what truly made our journey memorable were the people of Amsterdam. From the friendly greetings at local shops to the insightful stories shared by our guides, the warmth and openness of the locals made us feel at home in this foreign land. As we close this chapter, let Amsterdam's spirit of tolerance, its celebration of diversity, and its rich cultural legacy inspire you in your future travels. May the city's canals and cobblestones, its art and its heart, stay with you long after you've departed its shores. Safe travels and may your journeys always be filled with such enriching and memorable experiences.